Hello friends, this video on solid states part 19 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. X-ray diffraction studies shows that copper crystallizes into FCC unit cell. So let's first draw FCC. This is my FCC. With the cell edge of 3.608 10 to the power minus 8 centimeter. So this length is given. 3.6 0, 8 into 10 to the power minus 8 centimeter. In another experiment, copper is determined to have density of densities 8.92 gram per centimeter cube. So here you have to calculate the atomic mass of the copper. Since it is FCC, we know that Z is what? 4. There are 4 atoms in this cell correct so the formula we know that with the formula we had was d is equal to z into molecular mass by na divided by eq what did you find m so the same formula will rewrite we'll get m is nothing but d into Na into Aq by Z. Correct. Let's put the value. Density is what? 8.92 gram per centimeter cube. 8.92 gram per centimeter cube. Please put the units also. Into Na. Na we know that regular number 6.022 into 10 to the power 23 atoms per mole. Correct. Into A cube, A is what? Length. This is given 3.608 into 10 to the power minus 8 cube. And the unit will be centimeter cube. Divide by, the whole thing is divided by Z. And Z is just 4 without any units. This centimeter cube, centimeter cube will cancel. Right. And uh, yeah. So with this, when you solve this, you get 63.1 unit will be gram, gram or yeah, and this is atom actually, 4 atom, so it cancels, gram per mole. So this is nothing but my atomic mass, so atomic mass is nothing but 63.1. And that is my answer. Just application of the formula. We'll take one more example now. Silver forms CCP lattice and X-ray. So first form, let's try to create the CCP lattice. And X-ray studies of its crystal shows that the edge of its length is 408.6 picometer. Calculate the density. Again, since it is CCP, Z is nothing but 4. Correct. Now, I have to find density of silver. To density, we have this formula density is equal to Zm by a cube into n a so let's see if i have all the values z i know 4 m is molar mass we know, we know the atomic mass is 107.9 a is uh, length we have this length n a is something we know right so let's find the value z is 4 okay 4 M is the molar mass, it is 107.9 gram per mole. Please write the units properly, else you may get confused by A cube. What is A cube? A cube is uh, A is 408.6 picometer, so 
408.6 picometer I'll convert into centimeter into 10 power minus 10 centimeter cube why because I want density in gram per centimeter cube this is gram Na what is Na Na is nothing but 6.022 10 to the power minus or 10 to the power 23 Uh, atoms per mole I think atoms per mole and this is four atoms actually cancel more mole also cancel so with this you solve this you give 10.5 gram per centimeter cube and that is my answer okay. Let's take one numerical. What is the two dimensional coordination number of a molecule in square closed pack layer? So let's draw the square closed pack layer. Asked for two dimensional coordination number, we have seen that this, for example, this atom is linked to one, two, three, four other atoms. So coordination number will be four. Pretty easy. Since it is two dimensional, it's pretty easy. A compound forms hexagonal closed pack structure. This is my hexagonal closed pack structure. What is the total number of voids in 0.5 mole of it? And how many of these are tetrahedral voids? See, we know that n molecules will get n octahedral void, n 2 n tetrahedral void. This is something we know. So if we can just find the number of molecules, we can easily find the number of octahedrals and tetrahedral voids. And say that it's 0.5 mole. So 0.5 mole means what? 0.5 mole means 0.5 into 6.022 into 10 to the power 23 molecules or atoms. Right? Okay, number of atoms. And you can take any of these, doesn't matter. This is nothing but 3.011 into 10 to the power 23 atoms. So we have these many atoms. Since we have these many atoms, number of tetrahedral voids is what? Double of this. That is 6.022 into 10 to the power 23. Double of this. Number of octahedral voids. Similar to this, that is nothing but 0.0011 to the power 23. If you add these, you get what? 9.03 into 10 to the power 23 voids. Okay. So the question says a compound is formed by two element M and N. The M N forms CCP. So let's form CCP. N forms the CCP. And atoms of M occupy somewhere in the void. One third of tetrahedral voids. What is the formula of compound? See, if N is equal to X, let's suppose, M will be what? One third of tetrahedral voids. And tetrahedral void is what? 2X. We have seen that tetrahedral void is double of the number of atoms. Remember 1 by 3 into 2x. That is the value of m. Because m is nothing but one third of tetrahedral voids. It is 2 by 3x. Find the find the find the m is to n ratio. Nothing but m is 2 by 3x. It's 2x. That is something but 2 is to 3. That means m2 n3 is the formula. Correct. Which of the following lattice has the highest packing efficiency? Simple cube, body centered, and hexagonal. So we have seen that simple cube has a packing efficiency of 52.4% almost. Body centered almost 68%. We have seen this uh, numerical. And hexagonal 74%. This is the max. Hexagonal closed pack has the maximum efficiency. 
एलिमेंट विद मोलर मास ऑफ 2.7 पॉइंट सेवन टेन टू पावर माइनस ट्वेंटी के जी पर मोल फॉर्म्स अ क्यूबिक यूनिट सेल विद एज लेंथ ऑफ फोर जीरो फाइव पिकोमीटर डेंसिटी इज दिस वट इज द नेचर ऑफ क्यूबिक यूनिट सेल टू फाइंड वट इज द नेचर ऑफ क्यूबिक यूनिट सेल हाउ कैन डू वी कैन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ जेड जेड इज वन सिंपल क्यूब टू देन इट इज अ बॉडी सेंटर फोर दैट मीन्स द फेस सेंटर करेक्ट सो वी है दिस फॉर्मूला डेंसिटी इज इक्वल टू एम जेड एन ए वाई ए क्यू आई टू फाइंड जेड जेड इज नथिंग बट डी एन ए ए क्यू बाई एम सो लेट्स पुट द वैल्यूज इन द फॉर्मूला ना और जेड इज इक्वल टू डी इज वॉट डेंसिटी इज गिवेन टू पॉइंट सेवन टेन टू द पावर थ्री के जी पर मीटर क्यूब सो एवरी थिंग इज इन के जी यूनिट्स लेट्स पुट दैट टू पॉइंट सेवन टेन टू पावर थ्री के जी पर मीटर क्यूब इंटू एन ए एन ए इज नथिंग वर्ट माइनस सिक्स पॉइंट जीरो टू थ्री टेन टू पावर ट्वेंटी थ्री एटम्स पर वोल डन ए क्यूब सिंस दिस इज मीटर क्यूब टू कन्वर्ट दिस ए इंटू मीटर फोर जीरो फाइव पीको मीटर नथिंग बट फोर जीरो फाइव इंटू ट्वेंटी पावर माइनस ट्वेल्व मीटर फोर क्यूब डिवाइड बाय एम एम इज नथिंग बट मोलर मास so molar mass if you see it is coming out it has to be in the form of kg now correct because this is kg kg and kg has to cut so molar mass is given in the form of kg only 2.7 tend to minus 2 kg per mole 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 cancel kg kg cancels meter cube meter cube cancels so with this you solve you get 338 384 or actually 384 into 20 power minus 2. That is almost equal to 4. That is nothing but 3.84. Almost equal to 4. Since it's almost equal to 4, it is CCP. Correct. Please take care of the units. You have to convert this picometer into meter, else it won't cancel. Question is what is coordination number? Coordination number is nothing but the nearest number of neighbors is the sum of the nearest number of neighbors is called coordination number. And what is the coordination number in case of these uh, cubic closed pack structure and body center? So this is my cubic closed pack. This is body center. So we know that in uh, cubic closed pack structure, this one we have coordination number twelve, and here we have coordination number eighteen. This you can see here. You take this atom one two three four five six seven eight are touched to it actually, and you take this atom if you see, then you have one two three four five here, and then no no not each of these are touching actually, but if you see this has twelve coordination. See the way it is. Let's let's take this atom. Char atom. So it is in touch with one, two, three, four here, and one, two, three, four here. This is four. This is four. Correct. Four on the corners. Four on this. Now there will be one more unit cell on top of this, exactly same as this. If you take this part and pull it here, because this will be complete atom, right? Correct. Now this will also be in touch with the next four face centered here. Correct because see there will be one more uh, cell above it. Exactly, you copy this part, hold part, this part, and paste it on top of this and visualize it because this atom will merge on this, and you'll see it is touching four more here. Correct. So plus four, four plus four plus four that is twelve. So it has coordination number of. The question is how will determine atomic mass of a known metal if density and dimension is given? Pretty easy. We have derived this formula: density is equal to Z m n a to a q. So to find atomic mass, density is given, dimension of the unit cell is given, and n a is something we know it's a constant number. So we can easily find the molar mass. Now.
Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch more videos. Attempt free online tests, get pre-study materials, find tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.